Kawasaki has earned the right to milk a championship hangover with two WSBK titles to its credit in the past three seasons. But Team Green isn't falling into any such slumber, as the Ninja ZX-10R has undergone a major generational update for 2016. At stake is more than simply providing reigning team rider Jonathan Ree the best possible platform on which to defend the crown. Of greater importance to sales, is a long overdue shot of topping the stock leader bike shootouts. As so often stated in the past by any given manufacturer, Kawasaki says the goal of the project was to make the ZX-10R easier to ride fast. To this end, the electronic suite that has largely gone unchanged since first appearing on the 10R in 2011 has seen major improvement. This includes a completely revamped Sport Kawasaki Traction Control SKTRC, newly added engine brake control, a launch control mode, quick shifter, and smarter optional kibs Kawasaki Intelligent Braking System Cornering ABS. The system now utilizes a Bosch 5-axis inertial measurement unit IMU, measuring longitudinal, transverse, and vertical acceleration along with roll and pitch rates. Kawasaki's proprietary software calculates yaw rate, a sixth degree of freedom said to sense the rear end stepping out during a power slide. Kawasaki touts this latest SKTRC system as the most advanced of all current offerings due to its predictive rather than reactive nature of maximizing cornering grip and exit drive. Mechanical changes are many with nearly a pound shaved from the crankshaft along with a lighter engine balancer and slipper clutch, resulting in quicker response, acceleration, and improved transitional steering agility. A redesigned cylinder head features straighter and wider ports, 1mm larger diameter titanium exhaust valves, T intakes as well, long reach spark plugs flanked by larger liquid cooling passages, and a revised combustion chamber for improved intake slash exhaust efficiencies. Shorter slash lighter pistons made of a new heat resistant alloy have a dry film lubricant coating on the skirts said to reduce friction at low RPM. Feeding the Fury are a bank of 47mm ride-by-wire throttle bodies drawing from a 25% larger 10-liter Ram airbox incorporating a less restrictive air filter offering 1.6 times the surface area of its predecessor. Spent gases exit through a titanium alloy header said to have pipe diameters and length very similar to Ray's used headers. There's certain potential for pairing the lightweight header with an aftermarket slip-on arrangement to shed the weight and bulk of the stainless steel under-engine pre-chamber with exhaust valve and stock muffler. The new vertically stacked cassette-style transmission has revised ratios providing slightly lower bottom and top gears and more evenly spaced gaps throughout the six-speed box. The quick shifter trigger is a non-contact potentiometer type sensor on the shift rod allowing for the auto blip downshift feature that is unlocked with the optional race kit EQ. A wide range of engine and chassis race kit parts for the new ZX-10R will be readily available through Kawasaki dealers.